Well, Lee, another worthwhile workout. What did you take from that one today? Uh, got minutes, valuable 90 minutes into the players and uh, no injuries. Very good workout. I think um, a lot of stuff that we've been working on in training, we put it to practice and, uh, and, and they've done it really well. A first outing for you in front of that away following and a lot of the players as well. It was some reception, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. Made me get goosebumps and just just a reminder of, of how good they are. So um, really grateful. But yeah, I'm looking forward to getting back home and and seeing seeing the stadium really bouncing, you know. So, um, but that was a little taster. Probably good for the players as well because they're not playing in front of anyone for a long, long time now. So again, to give them a taster and a bit of pressure, like because the fans they're, they're firm but fair. So it's a little taster, but hopefully they went home today and, and, and liked a lot of the stuff that, that, that we done, because I did. Um, so yeah, hopefully they've gone home with, uh, obviously a bit disappointed that you lose, no one wants to lose, but there was a lot of good things that they, they, they would have seen today. What was it about the, the performance in particular that, that pleased you? Lots of work goes on on the training pitch day after day. Little patterns of play, delivery from wide areas. There's, there's bits you can pick out of today's performance. Yeah, just fit to exactly that. Like starting from the goalkeeper and, and can we work the ball instead of just going from back to front? Um, can, can we work the ball from A to B to C? And, and, and then maybe out create a chance at the end of it, and, and that's what we've done time and time again. More so second half. How we didn't score three, four, five goals in the second half, I'll never know. Um, but again, the most pleasing for me today is that we created them chances. If we weren't creating them, then I would worry. But I've just said to them there, like, well done. More so second half. Um, the goals, obviously, poor goals. Um, so that's something we have to touch on but apart from that I thought it was it, it was a good day. Because of the, the Salford friendly this morning as well it allowed more players to get more minutes which is important at this stage of pre-season with just two weeks to go. Yeah that's, that's the most important thing is the minutes and no injuries um, so yeah a lot of them got 90 minutes into them, valuable 90 minutes and then we've got another one next weekend and they get another 90 in them and then and then we kick start the season so but they look fit to me the yeah. boys look in good shape but they're, they're they're doing things that they've come a long way in a short space of time and that's what i've said to them like to play how we just played from back to front moving moving the ball as well as what they did to create the chances they've come a long way in a short space of time so we'll only get better and better as the season goes on but yeah, it's really pleasing for me standing there because I'm asking them to do something that's way out of their comfort zone, some of them, you know. But then like, I see Ryan Woods getting on the ball and I'm thinking that's exactly why you're here. Yeah. Like, just spraying the ball around and, and putting his body on the line and winning it back. And, you know, and, and you've got Gary Garner arriving late in the box and should have scored, but, but didn't. Um, so, yeah, a lot of things. Djokovic scoring, Harry always scores. Arriving, Edda, great cross from wide, like, but it takes time. You have to be patient at times, and that's what we, we had to do. The two strikers dropped deep, let our back four have it, and then we had to work it, work it, and, and then we get the opening Christian cross. So they must have had a, a good few passes before Christian's, before Christian's cross, and, and it was a great goal, you know. I think our goals were, both goals were very good. When you know, as we say, a couple of weeks now, one more dress re rehearsal next week, and then we're into the the league campaign. Are you pleased with where they are at this stage of pre-season? Yeah, fitness and uh, in in and out of possession. I think they're they're in a good place, and we've still got two weeks, and that's what I said to them. Two weeks is a long time yeah. now to get ready for the first game, and and they're that far in front now. I like to think um, that's the way it looks to me that we 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 finish strong as well. So uh, so yeah, another two weeks, and then we're. We'll definitely be ready, I think. Yeah, very finally from me, how's Ivan Sunjic? And Tahif Chung joins the group this week, so that's a, another addition to the group. Yeah, Tahif was in today, uh, first time meeting him face to face. Um, so good to see him, looking forward to working with him. I think he'll bring another good addition to the squad. Uh, and, and, and Ivan, he's, he's, he obviously took that knock 
before the last game and it just ain't really settled down how we would like to. He tried running on Thursday, just feeling it a little bit, so there's no point taking any risks. So he's a fit lad anyway, naturally fit. So, um, so yeah, hopefully one day this week he'll be back in training, uh, next week, sorry, he'll be back in training.